a little bit closer to home. The countdown is on. Thunder over Louisville is this Saturday, the official kickoff to the Derby season and opening night at Churchill Downs is just under two weeks. Are you getting excited yet? I know I am. I cannot wait. I know somebody else too that is really fired up to report on her big Derby experience here and she's with one of my favorite people, Tanya Avelin, GDL reporter, uh, Naila Spencer. Hey there, Naila. Hey, Claudia, you are exactly right. We're just under two weeks from opening night, and we couldn't be more excited to be kicking off derby season here at Churchill Downs. We're actually joined right now with Tanya Ablin. She's their vice president of corporate communications. So I know that you picked this spot especially. Tell me, where are we? Well, right now we are next to the Twin Spires and we're overlooking the racetrack. And on a day like today, the track would be what we would call sloppy. So the first thing that we need to happen is for Mother Nature to get her act together. Because like you said, we're 12 days from opening night, 19 days from the Kentucky Derby. Um, so on Derby Day, on opening night, we'll have um, fans who are part of our premium dining experience out here shoulder to shoulder looking at the races and cheering for their favorite. Yes, yeah, so I think we're all super excited about that. And then just turning a little bit more to opening night. I know you said it's going to be a little bit different. It's going to be more of a fashion theme thing. So tell me about that. Yeah, you're exactly right. We um, this, The theme for opening night this year is style under the stars. And so we're encouraging our fans to put on either their most outrageous outfits, think avant-garde, really push themselves in terms of fashion, think aspirational derby fashion, maybe what you're afraid to wear to the track on Derby Day, something a little less traditional. We have roads for him and for her. Um, they're going to do a beautiful fashion show in the Aristides Garden. And we have Gunnar Detheridge, who is a fashion designer from Louisville, Kentucky. He resides in Los Angeles now. He has over 3 million TikTok followers. Um, he's incredibly famous now worldwide. And he's going to do a fashion installation for us on the plaza. It'll be very interactive, very cool. So we're inviting people to come out, enjoy style under the stars, enjoy racing under the lights on opening night, April 30th. That's going to be so exciting. And then a special plug, also Eric King and Kaladi Coffee are going to be there emceeing, so that's going to be exciting. And speaking of fashion, obviously you have amazing fashion sense. As soon as she came in, I told her, I'm like, wow, I love the colors, everything. Tell me about your look and how it's kind of derby inspired. Well, I'm trying to summon the, the beautiful weather today with this look. I was like, we need something bright if we're going to talk about derby fashion. I got this at, at Glasscock 2, Jeff Hunter, a friend of mine. I know he dresses many people for derby week. Um, and that the hat, actually the fashion Fascinator is by one of our featured milliners, Forme Millinery. And so if we're talking about derby trends, you know, a lot of people have been wearing fascinators more lately. This year, I see more and more people going back to a traditional hat. So I think we'll see more of that at the track. I think so, too. And coming up, when we're back here, we're going to talk about some more fashion trends and other details about opening night in derby. Back to you, Claudia. Love it, love it, love it. Cannot wait.